been in a spot of bother. Got bit by a zombie on the way in from work. I don't think it notices too much. Maybe a bit of concealer. Oh, enough with the crap jokes. Hello YouTube, it's Joanna Delilah and I'm following up on the video I did with the stitched eye following the um, book from Matteo Arfanotti who is the most incredible artist and painter he's got this lovely little mini book with some step by steps in which one of them is this that I've followed um, and I used the products that he recommends in the book which are this little chameleon flesh tone palette and these two chameleon reds and all of those are available from Paintopia and I'll put the links in the, in the box but of course I hope you like it um, stay tuned if you want to see how I did it um, I don't think it's as well is it a patch on the original probably not really but I'm quite happy with it anyway I think it's a good um, you know a great alternative to sticking glue in things all over your face it's just all done with face paint just those palettes uh, the palette and the two reds so I hope you like it and please do continue to subscribe to my channel because I love it when you do that and um, give my video a thumbs up and a like and a share. Um, stay tuned if you want to see the video of how I did this makeup. Step one. I missed the teeth out. Silly me. Not ready for step two yet. Still on step one. Step two. <laughs> Step three. Which looks to me like it's adding um, some highlights now in between all the dark lines. And then I'm going to go in with a damp brush and just blend all of that together. So step four is where it suddenly just goes from this to looking completely awesome. Um, so I think this might take me a little bit of time. 
um, and it's really sharpening up over like you you've basically created a pattern um, and now you want to go in and really sharpen up and add some detail to all those lines so I'm going to switch to a tiny brush now and I'm going to start off using the darkest brown out of the palette and I might add a bit of black I think I'll paint the teeth in before I do that actually let's get that done I'm adding some of the dark red onto the red bits. Going over the lines at the moment with a brush with just a little bit of water on just to like soften the lines a little bit but with um, face painting you wanna you don't wanna lose the lines too much we're not really going for like movie realism as much as we are like a bold impact of the overall face <laughs> so if it gets blended too much you, you lose that go in with a little bit of black here and there there and here I'm going to add some little bits, highlights of white. I'm going to add a few more highlights just with the lighter flesh tone one from the palette I'm using. Add some highlights to the teeth. I'm just adding a bit more highlight and taking out some of those lines because looking back at the picture I think I went a bit over the top with me with me um, lines down the face. Got a bit carried away. Much better. should done do mess me hair up a bit <laughs> zombie with a neat little pin curl at the front of her head <sighs> thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed this video I really 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 appreciate all the likes and the comments and the people who subscribe I love you the best you're my favorites um, but yeah all the links of my website and Instagram and all of that jazz are in the box below please stay tuned and I'll do something else exciting next week um, yeah. bye for now Shut up, drill person. <laughs>